to our channel. If you guys are new to our channel, hi. please say hi. Elijah's in the background watching TV. Mom duties, you know. He got a new sleeping bag for his birthday, so he's laying down. I do have a little cooking vlog for you guys today. Something really easy, something really quick. If you can, if you guys are new to our channel, please subscribe for us. We would absolutely love that. Also, hit that little bell button so every time we post, you guys will get notified. And we love you guys. We love you guys for coming back and all of the support. My voice is a little scratchy. Got up not too long ago. Um, I have my coffee and my RBG fam coffee mug. Hit me up at Den Designs by Ness if you wanna get yours. So I have this um, cooking recipe that involves a crock pot. My friend Jen had posted it the other day on Instagram. Shout out to you, Jen Smallwood, because she always has these like delicious crock pot recipes. I believe I got the chicken enchilada one from her as well. So this one is actually called crock pot cream cheese chicken chili. And it's seriously so easy, you guys. I love recipes like this, especially when I know I have to work tonight. Like I have to work tonight, so I really don't want to cook like anything big. I can leave the crock pot on for six hours and that's it. All right, so I'm just gonna go ahead and read the um, ingredients to you guys really quick, super easy. So I just need a can of black beans. Um, I need a can of corn. I need a can of Rotel tomatoes. I need one package of ranch dressing. I need one teaspoon of cumin, one tablespoon of chili powder. Ooh, I gotta grab that. One teaspoon of onion powder. You guys, I thought I had onion powder, but it is onion salt, but I'm gonna use it anyways. Uh, one package of cream cheese, and I have two chicken breasts right here. So really, you guys, I'm just gonna put this all in the crock pot, super easy. I'm gonna show you guys what I have laid out here, okay? So real quick, just a quick view of everything that I'm using right here. I went ahead and just seasoned my chicken a little bit with some salt and pepper. I think it's just preference and I like salt and pepper, so yeah. And I love cream cheese. So let's get started, guys. And Oh yeah, and the crock pot. All right, fam bam, so the first thing that I'm gonna do is grab both of my chicken breasts. I try to get um, like a good size chicken breast. I don't want them too small. I feel like the more chicken, the better. I don't know. So I just basically placed my um, chicken breast at the bottom of the crock pot. Here's my crock pot. If you guys don't know. And there's my chicken. And basically I'm just gonna go down the line of all my ingredients and start placing everything into the crock pot. Corn, um, non-drain, they don't want you to drain it. They want you to keep the juice, so. I love these like easy um, can opener little handles. It makes it so much easier. Pouring in my corn. Rotel tomatoes. I've actually never used these. Diced tomatoes with lime juice and cilantro. Ah, interesting. I'm gonna pour this whole can in as well. And I already opened, drained, and rinsed my black beans. I feel like I kinda want more black beans. This is the first time I've ever made this recipe, you guys, so I don't really know what to expect. I'm gonna go by the ingredients, and I think the next time I make it, if I need to add more chicken or more black beans, I like I said, I think it's just all really preference, so we'll see um, what the one can of black beans does. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and pour in my ranch dressing seasoning right here, just one package. That's what it says, one package of ranch seasoning. Ah! One package of ranch going in. You're sick? Okay, lay down if you don't feel good, okay? Layla's actually sick upstairs. But I told him that Layla, that his sissy's sick, so he's acting sick now. <laughs> cumin, one teaspoon of cumin. I actually really like cumin, it smells so good. One teaspoon. Chili powder, one tablespoon of chili powder. Hi guys. Mm, that's a lot. Hi guys. You guys, I think Elijah needs his own YouTube channel. What do you guys think? Comment, comment down below if you guys think Elijah needs his own channel. I think he's ready. Hold on, baby. Let me pour this in because this is really hot. Oh my gosh, you guys. I just ah, I just got the chili powder everywhere. I like, did not want to come out. So I have one tablespoon of chili powder right here. I feel like this is kind of a lot, guys, but all right. Okay, say hi to the fam bam. Hi. Say mommy's cooking. Okay. What are we cooking? Next I have um I have my little cooking helper right here. Are you gonna be my cooking helper? Yeah. Alright. <laughs> Alright guys, like I said, um I don't have onion powder, so I'm using my onion salt. Mom life. <laughs> Alright guys, and um one teaspoon of my onion salt. Cute. Cute? Make it. My food is cute? Yeah. 
Oh, I'm glad you think my food is cute. <laughs> One teaspoon of onion salt, guys, going in. And last but not least, I have the cream cheese. I'm gonna go ahead and have Elijah put this in for me, my little helper. On the website, it actually shows the cream cheese kind of like broken in half. So I'm gonna place one in. Elijah, you wanna place one in? Mommy's gonna put hers right here. And then you can put yours in there too. Put it right there. Oh my gosh, that's such a good job. You're such a big helper, high five. Yeah, do you wanna wash your hands? No. No? So next, I'm just basically gonna mix some of the ingredients around. Uh, but I'm gonna try to leave the cream cheese on top because I think it's supposed to kind of like melt everywhere on top. I love cream cheese, you guys, it's so good. And that is it, you guys. This is seriously the easiest recipe. If you look at the pictures on the website, it looks so good. My friend Jen said it's delicious. It only takes six hours, so it should be done by probably no later than four o'clock, which is perfect because I usually leave to work around 5.40 wet. Oh, Dad! And the hubby will also have dinner. Yes! High fives! Yeah! So there, <laughs> there it is with Elijah's hand. You guys have to try this recipe, wow. it's so, so easy. Okay, get out of my cream cheese, kid. All right, fam bam, I'm gonna put the lid on, turn my crock pot on for six hours, let's go. All right, fam bam, it is now 3.45, the crock pot. Oh, it just beeped, it's done. It's done, you guys, and it smells so good. Robert just texted me, he was taking a nap, he's like, is the food ready? Because I'm hungry and it smells good. So, let me just show you guys what it looks like. Don't mind me, I have a purple mask on my hair, and then I'm gonna take a shower because I gotta get ready for work. Oh my gosh, you guys, it smells so good, and it looks so good. That is it, you guys. I'm so excited to taste this. By the way, I do like to eat rice as um, one of my sides whenever I'm cooking something like this, like in the crock pot, so I would either do like white rice, but today I did Spanish rice. That's done right there. Basically, I'm just gonna put a little bit of rice in the bowl and just kind of top it with this chicken casserole that I made right here. Let's try it out. Here it goes. Mm. Oh my gosh, you guys. It is so good. I don't wanna eat too much now because I am gonna take some for dinner because I do work tonight. I'm catching up on The Walking Dead right now. I'm doing laundry. I was just waiting for this to be done, and I gotta jump in the shower. Babe, did you cook something today? Oh, shoot. Oh, it's the Crock-Pot Cream Cheese Chicken Chili. This is it, you guys. We'll post it in the description for you guys. It's so good, though. It's almost like a little bit, like a soup, kind of, but I, like I said, I kind of added some rice in there just to, you know, be a little bit more full, so or not. Yeah, well, I'm yeah. trying to get full. What's cracking? Mmm. Mm. Okay. So you like that in front of me? Oh, man. Um, and yeah, look at that. It's so good. You just fogged up the screen. That's I know. how good it is. That happened to me earlier, too. How funny. You good. ready to eat? I'm ready. All right. All right, Bam Bam, here we go. Mm. Oh. <laughs> what did you do? Mmm. I'm about to aim my sorry this. Hold on. Oh, it tastes good. It's so chickeny. I can taste the beans. Do you like beans? What do beans do to you? Do you fart? Mmm. It's really good, babe. So anyway, Pam Pam, I just woke up from a nap. How's your day going? How's your night going? The Heinz gotta go to work today. Work a 12-hour shift? You need to stay longer. We need a bigger check. Okay. I had to go to the pool supply store real quick. Go test my water in my pool. See if we're doing okay because of the rain and everything. My wife thinks I'm cheating on honor with the with the pool guy. She says I'm going to Leslie's. She's like, who's Leslie? <laughs> anyway, going to the pool place. Then I got to go to AutoZone and pick up a battery for my uh, car. Enough about that. I'm gonna enjoy this. All right. <laughs> Okay, fam bam, so I'm off to AutoZone or Walmart. I don't know, I think Walmart got cheaper batteries, but I'm gonna hit up AutoZone so they can do a test on this battery here, cause it's not starting. The car's been sitting for a few months cause I've been driving the Nissan. Well, as you know, I took the Nissan back. So, yeah, that looks pretty 
corroded, but I don't know, it just might need to be cleaned. Oh, Are you into <laughs> I'm busting out my credit card like it's, I gotta pay. <laughs> so this one had a five year, huh? Mm-hmm. It, the warranty won't start over, it's still gonna be off the old one, so you'll have like probably a couple more months of a warranty, uh -huh. and then I'll go back to prorated. When did I purchase it? Uh, uh, 2017. Oh, wow, so it's due. There's your swipe receipt, man, and you're all set. Thanks, boss. Yep, have a good one. You too. Boy, all I gotta say is God is good, fam bam. I walked in there, and you basically heard the conversation. My battery that I purchased last time in 2017, was uh, still under warranty, had a five year warranty, I didn't even know. I expected to come in and at least trade it in and get a discount because you sometimes they'll give you a discount on that. But yep, got it for free, man. It's a $130 battery right there. Considering I just spent um, like 250 to get my key fob replaced, which is another story. Yeah, that worked out. <laughs> Some extra change in my pocket. All right, Fat Bam, so we are back inside the house. Mommy went to work. And Elijah has one last gift left from his Uncle birthday. Trucks. Huh, folks? Uncle Monster Trucks. Well, let's see if it's a monster truck. Monster Uncle. Who's this from? Cousin Raylene? Yeah. Of course, it's another Paw Patrol bag. Oh. Woohoo! All right. The old Disney Turtles. Teenage Mutant Turtles. We got pizza. Look. Got pizza? Yeah, yeah. Pops, you love pizza, huh? You see another shirt? Open it up. Oh, no, these are shorts. Teenage Mutant Turtles, fam, fam. All right, fam, bam, that is it. I really, really hope that you guys do enjoy my cooking with Ness vlogs as much as I love doing them for you guys. If you guys would like more, let me know down below if you guys can. If our comments are still not disabled, I don't know, guys. I don't know but I don't like it at all. If you guys would like to make this dish, you guys already know that the link will be in the description below. That is it, but we do actually do have a postification shout out for you guys. We did get our postification shout out from our community tab and that goes to Juan Ramirez. Shout out to you, thank you so much for watching our YouTube channel. We love you for that. If you guys would like a postification shout out, all you guys have to do is one, subscribe to our YouTube channel, to hit the little bell button so that right every time we post you guys will get notified and when you're done comment down below hashtag done and if you can't go to our community page and comment down there hashtag done we will get some of our shout outs from there since our comments are disabled right now what's up with that i love you guys have a good night or a good day or a good morning bye